Hello again, YouTubers. This is Even Ball, and it is April 13th, 2014. And I got another batch of games here for you. So we're going to kick it right off. With uh, I went to a Goodwill, and I found a bunch of things. And uh, this is one of the ones I found. Dissidia Final Fantasy. Only six bucks. Uh, it's pretty much a going price for this anyways. There were a lot of games there. A lot. I had to uh, choose carefully because this particular Goodwill kind of overcharges everything. Everything is between five to ten dollars and even if it's a sports game it's five dollars so I uh, I gotta choose. Uh, there were a lot of PSP games and a lot of Xbox games there so this is one of them and moving right along here ah, I thought there were a few Dreamcast games there including Shinmu. Yep, Shinmu. This is complete. It's only seven bucks. That's not a bad deal at all for Shinmu. It has all four discs and the uh, instructions. I do have a disc only version of this, but uh, it's it's uh, defective. It says the second disc is not working properly, so glad to get this complete and all the discs are in great shape. So, moving right along, we also have Marvel vs. Capcom. It's only five bucks. It's also a pretty good deal. This case is a little bit bad. This doesn't cling on to it, this, the instructions. But it's all there. And I'm looking forward to playing this. This looks like a lot of fun. All right. At a smaller thrift store, I found these. These are Nintendo DS cases. And I could always use a few Nintendo DS cases. I got some Game Boy Advance games and some DS games that are... Well, I mean, hard to open these with one hand, but there we go. And it's got place for both of them, so that'll be, that'll be worth it. These are only 50 cents each. Pretty good price for these. And it was on sale, so I actually got seven of these for three bucks. It's a pretty good deal, I think. Always on the lookout for those. Speaking of Game Boy Advance, I also got... This is... I don't normally buy these, but I thought I'd get this one anyways. Game Boy Advance Video, SpongeBob SquarePants Volume 2. Looks like SpongeBob's been eating some Chipotle there, but... Looks pretty good. The uh, video quality on these is... Pretty terrible. I should probably play it to to show you. It's it's pretty bad. Let me get this plugged in. Not compatible with Game Boy Player. Well, that's probably for the best. This is terrible video. Terrible quality video. But it's at least an interesting thing to have. You can really see the pixelation there. It's pretty terrible. But, you know, these uh, cartoons aren't too bad. It says it's got four of, on the, of them on there, but uh, it's really only two episodes worth. It's not really all that great. Alright, that's enough of that. I decided to get this because it was complete. I mean, uh, I don't see these normally with uh, with everything. This has the instructions, I guess, and, and everything else. It did not cost me 20 bucks. It cost me only uh, $4, so that's not too bad for a complete uh, Game Boy Advance. Well, it's a video, but uh, moving right along. I also got an Xbox game this week, and it is The Warriors. Ah yes, the classic 1979 film turned video game by Rockstar. Who else? But yeah, they are the perfect people to make a game off based off of the Warriors. And I, I'm going to boot this up. Should be a lot of fun. And I also have a GameCube game of the week. And it is not that exciting, but it's alright. Uh, Fantastic Four. This is half price. It was only uh, two bucks, so... Didn't overpay too much for this thing. But, yeah, I 
hoping it's better than the movie, but I, uh, I'm not going to hold my breath. I'm sure it's just a quick cash-in title. And the last game of the week is King of the Fighters 99 for the PlayStation. I'm sure this will be pretty good. SNK fighters are always great. And for the PlayStation, I'm sure it's I'm sure it's gonna be fine despite the memory constraints of the PlayStation and product property of Blockbuster Video. It's actually, you know, for a Blockbuster game, the the disc is in great shape and everything's included, so no complaints there. Anyways, that's all for this week. Hopefully I'll have more next week. I I might I might only have a couple of items depending on whether or not I pick up a certain item next week or not. It's kind of expensive. We'll see if I do that or not. Uh, anyways, I'll see you next week.